my real life Annabelle doll has no chill. Like the little girl don't care about nothing. And at this point, I'm done reasoning with the child. Scoot, go do what you want to do and we'll see what happens, okay? Last night, we sitting in my house and the little girl says, Daddy, can we go walk downtown? And I'm like, well, yeah, it feels great. It's dusk where it's not really light out anymore. It's not really dark, but it feels amazing. Let's go walk. Well, close to downtown is the cemetery. Now, this cemetery, I'm pretty sure ain't nobody been buried in it in over 100 years. Like, it's prehistoric. All the tombstones and the headstones has got the mossy green stuff all over them. You can barely read what the dates are and what their names are and everything else like that. Well, we're walking, and as we go to walk past it, there are two little girls standing on the sidewalks, and they are stuck. Like, they are frozen solid. Like, they just saw something in that cemetery that has got them scared to death. Now, I walk up to them with Scoot right here, and I'm like, hey, are y'all okay? And they're like, yeah, we're just, we're not really fond of cemeteries. We're scared to go past it. I'm like, well, cool. Well, we're walking right past it. You can just walk with us. So, as we walk past the cemetery, we're talking. Hey, how you doing? Good to see you. How your mom and them's doing? Great. As we get past the cemetery, the little girls turn to say thank you and continue on their way. And Scoot says, you don't have to thank me. I used to be scared, too, when I was alive. Huh? I ain't never heard two girls scream that loud, and I'm talking about ass hauling down the road. I mean, they took off. Hussein Bolt couldn't have caught them. I look back, and Scoot is just laughing her little ass off. Why do you think that's funny? You just, you have ruined those children, those babies, for the rest of their life. I used to be scared, too, when I was alive. Go home!